What's up guys, it's Nerp here, and today I'll play more Rocket League. So my updated ratings in these are, I'm um, 49 in solo duel, 146 in doubles, 50 in solo standard, and 63 in regular standard. I don't know why uh, I'm so much better at doubles than solo duel and regular standard. Like, I suck in regular standard. Solo duel, I think I'm okay, and I'm still, like, I keep, I, I have been losing a lot, but I think that's because I keep choking. Like... I always seem to go like a 3-1 lead and then I just like lose it. I don't know why. Hopefully I can get a win here though. So I'm just going to play some solo duel here. And uh, so we're playing a setting pro. That shouldn't be too bad. The beginning here I will go like that and perfect. Yeah the Merc's really nice because if you just boost right into it, the Merc I'm speaking of the car I have. Uh, if you boost right into it, it will kind of just like go right in. I went a little to the side so he wouldn't have an easy jump up save. It didn't seem like he was ready for that either. So I'm sure now he's going to run forward. So looks like yeah, he's running forward now. So I'm going to do a double tap forward. Fortunately, that goes towards my side. Uh, I'll try to knock this away. Is that going to go over him? Oh, that was nice. It's on a goal though. Okay. It's pretty good at like getting it uh where it needs to be. Alright, there we go. Is that on target? Oh that's my nice save by him. Nice. Huge clear ball. Oh shoot, missed that. It's that, but I kind of, I touched it so you couldn't get a good shot off of it. I kind of just centered it for him. I got a save for that? He got a shot and goal for that. That's interesting. Alright, finally. I just want to get it towards his goal again. There we go. kind of just dribbled it in there. I want to see this. A little bit of a juke out. Okay, diagonal, I think we're both just gonna go for it. First touch, but now it's over there. Grab boost to my guy. I see he's running away, so he thinks I'm just gonna defend it. Oh, that's bad. I was hoping to screw that up. <laughs> I don't know if people get mad at me for usually not skipping the replays, but I like watching them. I think they're kind of cool. Like, I don't only watch mine, I like watching all of them. A lot of times it's like hard to see what happened in the actual game, so you need the replay. I guess you like staying down there to like stop it. Uh oh. Ah, I guess I could have got that on target if I was lucky. Oh shoot, I overran that. I'm just gonna hit it off the wall here. There we go. More dribbling it in. There's a hat trick, yeah, this is what I'm saying, like in a in a two versus two, getting a hat trick would be like really good. Uh but then in a one versus one, like you're just gonna like that's like a normal win. Three goals is like a pretty normal win. But then both of them go in your stats the same and affect your goals per game the same. Oh, I just screwed that. He jumped past it. I had an easy shot. Yeah, I'll let him go for it. Yep, thank you. Oh. I was gonna say that he helped me out there and that looks like he helped himself out with a. Alright. Up one with a 238 anybody's game. Don't go for it. He's going for it. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well. Also, it feels like I tend to not get the uh, first touch off a lot. It feels like it's usually somebody else. Oh, that was a good shot. Right into the corner. Well, now it's tied. And. 
and I really want to win here. I don't want to drop further below 50. See, how come it always just does that? Like, how do I, how do I get it more consistently going towards, uh, going towards their, their goal? Like, I just boost forward and then hit it, but it seems like 65% of the time it's going back towards me. Oh god. That sucks. Like, I guess I was kind of off target that episode 3. I wanted to see if I get it in. Right, there we go. That's more towards his side. Oh, but he's right there. Yeah, I think he's pretty good. This is what I'm talking about. These games I have, it's always like I take a lead in the beginning. Alright, there we go. One down. It's usually I take the lead in the beginning, like it's only like 3 1, I think, which I was in this game. But then I always like give up like a bunch of goals off of like the touch. Alright, one down, minute 53. Alright, there we go. So bad at those. I'm so bad at jumping sideways. Oh, is that going on goal first? I don't even know. See, I have to make those if I want to compete, like at a at like a ranked level. At least missed that. All right, there we go. I'm just gonna let that roll. Tie game with a minute eight. Well, we both have five goals. I have six shots. He's seven. Times for one save. Okay, let's hope he does not go for this. He's going for it. There we go. All right, now I'm getting some luckier, uh, luckier things to happen here. Ugh. Jumped a little late there. Yeah, I'm still very bad at aerial shots and overall doing things in the air. I have been getting more like jump hits recently because I've been actively trying to do that because it does help a lot. Just whenever if you. Okay. Oh, damn it. I, I want to actually see that. But like, uh, being able to jump hit consistently it helps so much because that way you can always just be able to touch it before the opponent. And that's going to come right down the goal. And I didn't really do a whole lot to that, but I guess I did put it off goal. Oh, he has a shot though. Good, he missed it, but I only have 30 seconds to score. Only to get it to overtime though, so I'm probably going to lose this anyway. Well, that's a goal. Kind of just dribbles in far. Missed it. Okay, so let's try not to give up a goal off the touch here. I can go down 76. Alright, there we go. And now, can I get a goal in 19 seconds? Well, it looks like I'm close to getting a goal than he is. Uh, I will push this this way. Alright, no, no go. Uh oh. Oh, that was close. Alright, don't have this in, please. <sighs> That's probably gonna roll in if uh, the game wasn't ending. I feel like I hate the like, ones where we both act now. I feel like uh, I'm just overall not as. not as good on those. Uh, it's towards the middle. Oh, that was like a save, even though it didn't give me a save, but like, I think that was going to go in. I think it was going to go off the uh, crossbar, but I kind of pushed it harder into the crossbar. Alright, come on. Ah, oh, I have no boost. That's why I like to get boost in the beginning. Like, in doubles, I'm able to just like, grab the boost. Grab boost in the game because my teammate will be able to get the touch. But in this, it's more like, uh, you just have to, I missed that, but it's not a huge deal, it's still in the corner, come on, can I jump a little too high, good, there we go, oh, I'm 
so bad at just like jumping. I missed the hats, but I'm getting lucky here at Brain Front. No, he was able to clear it or no center. I don't even know. Oh, all right, well, I had a decent shot at a gold there, but it was like a tiny bit faster. Okay, and get back in gold now. Oh, well, I was lucky I could have gotten that on target. And can I get this on target? I don't even know if that was on target. Yeah, I have a lot of work to do in this game. Let's say I have six goals here. That's a lot. That's good for the stats. Oh, I'm so bad because I just like, if it's in the air, I always screw it up. I don't always, sometimes I get lucky and get like great goal, great goals like everybody else, but I, I'm not like consistent at doing like anything in here. Okay, I'm just gonna get back. Oh, come on, please be on target. There we go, there's the win, 7-6 OT. I'm very happy with that win. Overtime goals are so sad, I think that's like 7th or something. I 7th and probably like 150 games or something. Okay, over 50, so now I feel good. Not that good. 10 shots, 7 goals. Okay, and it's been about 12 minutes of the video. I think we can fit another 1v1. Well, that was a slightly longer match because one's overtime. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna see how many overtime goals I have. Um, no aerial goals or bicycle goals yet, because I don't really do much aerial. I tried the aerial training to get to practice that, but that that was just uh, way too hard for me. I mean, I was able to get some of them, but it was like really just random and consistent for me, and I would not be, a, I would never be like not afraid to do that in a real match. See, that's like way too high, but I'm just gonna jump for it so I can get it before he does, but he got it anyways, but he didn't really move it, so that's good, I guess. And it's hard to see. Alright, well, I'm not sure what he was doing, but he's a pro, okay? Well, cool shot. That's my only my second full shot. Cool shot is when you hit the opponent into the ball uh, to get a goal. Yeah, I haven't really touched it since then. It's <laughs> a perfect cool shot. Okay. And it's back towards that way. I forget what I said last game about how I, I usually don't get it get it to go the direction I want it to off the touch. Uh like since then I've been getting most of them. Okay, that was this is a Pretty good shot. Like, if I stayed back, I was not going to defend that, probably. So I went forward, but he was just there, so I needed quicker. There we go. I saw, I saw that he was, like, a little slower to the ball, so I didn't do a boost thing. I just turned a little bit. That's a big thing in 1v1. You gotta, like, try to see what the other, what the other like, arrow on the car, is, how fast it's moving or whatever, so that, uh... You can adapt. Like there, I boosted because if I didn't boost, then maybe he would have touched it way before. That's not good. Oh, seems like uh, you have two goals here that are just like because I wasn't really there to defend me, so one too early for the ball. But then again, one or two of my goals are just uh, off the touch. Oh, I got a save there. That's going in, I guess. I didn't touch it. Wow. That was a pretty good save there. Because that was... Interesting. I guess at, at like a time like that, I should probably use boost. Doesn't really matter. No. Off target, slightly. Alright, come on. Can we... Can I get this in? Nice. I just got under it and bounced it up. 
hat trick. That's pretty good. Almost missed it. Okay, I'm gonna go right for this. Probably gonna go for it as well, so it looks like I'm gonna be doing. Oh, is he going for it? Nope. Well, he was a little too slow. That's what happens when you're too slow. Only one, you have to go for the ball. You can't delete it out of here. Somebody can just do this. Like, if he was boosting the hallway, he would have pushed it, like, at about the same time, so he wouldn't, wouldn't have gotten in. Okay. And... <laughs> that. There we go. Stole the ball from him. Slightly off target there. That was a nice shot. Okay, uh, that's like a really good shot actually. Look at this, I was actually, I put it, I did the jump perfectly, right in. I'm pleased with that one to be sure. To be sure, for sure. Yeah. I was trying to get that boost, but I missed it. Well, so have a lead to work with. I missed my boost forward. Okay. I was hoping it was going to go directly up the wall. Oh, missed that. And he's actually one goal down. Two and a half minutes left. So that's only half the game. And I am in trouble. But I think I'm, I think I'm like very often getting an early lead in these longer ones. But then I just always give up more goals. So I have to keep putting it on. Like yeah, a couple, a few games ago, I felt kind of bad because uh, I was playing Sony and I, I was just I kept playing hard and he just wasn't that good and I went up like nine one. I kind of felt bad for doing that because it seems like I was better than him. But I'm just afraid because I tend to give up leads pretty quickly. Oh, that's not good. Well, it's fine if uh, he messes the goal up. Nice, nice clear. I'm afraid I was gonna hit that in. Honestly, I probably would have hit that in like nine times out of ten. Okay, hit it. Hitting the opponent out of the way of the ball is always a fine idea. Like what he just tried to do there. Probably just because he was mad at me for touching it. Ah, that was uh, quite interesting. That. Whole turn of events there. He, let, he looped around the ball, stopped it for me, and then that was it for him. As long as he didn't screw it up, which is not a uh, which is not a unlikely thing to happen. With open goals, I don't always get them. Don't tell me it was right on target. That's no, not. Save for that? I was gonna roll more if I didn't touch it. I missed that. Ooh, probably mad about missing that. Well, I hit him away, and now the ball away, which I could not do. I'm fine. He's not gonna score. He's not gonna score uh, three goals in 50 seconds, and even then, there's a better chance. Well, now he scored two goals in 46 seconds. This is possible. No, back to back is that back to back seven goal games at least? It's pretty good, even though this is one versus one. And the 
that's not so good is that I'm down one now. <laughs> I'm up one now. Yeah, uh, I can't let him catch up here. Like, when this happens in 2 vs 2, where, like, you're a little bit ahead, like, I usually stay back and play more defensively, but in 1 vs 1, I feel like you can't do that, because, like, they just still get them in. Nice epic. That's not an epic save. I just kind of rolled up and hit that. Uh-oh. I'm scared. No! Yes. Missed it. He had a shot there if he uh, did it correctly. Good clear. That was a second save of this game, huh? And can I... There we go. Alright, he's not doing this. Eight goals, seven shots, two saves. Only seven shots, so I guess... Oh, I guess I didn't get a shot for my pool shot one. Because I kind of hit him into it, so it didn't give me a shot on target. Okay, can I score in three, two... I didn't even touch it. <laughs> oh. He almost knocked me into a... Oh. 69... Plus 10, and that's going to be it for today's video, so I guess I did pretty well. Two wins and 15 goals, but I also gave up 11 goals, but came, or actually no, I gave up 12 goals. But I came out of it with two wins, so that's really all that matters. Uh, I will see you next time. And by the way, guys, uh, I Duel is still expunds me, but I just feel like the game is just developing very slowly. Like, there's not... And I'm not, like, as big of a person in... I'm really nothing in the Duelist community. Like, nobody knows who I am. So I don't I don't feel, like, the connection to Duelist as I did with Scrolls just yet, at least. Uh, so I'm, I'm, I'm not, like, giving up on it. But, like, I'm not really feeling the desire to play. I don't know. Um, so, yeah. I will see you next time.